Hello Capricorn, welcome to Brittle True Tarot and this reading is from 21st of April to 27th of April. So let's check what is the message for you. Messages for Capricorn. What you can expect in this week. Temperance, Two of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, Two of Cups, and um, Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so here we have Card of Temperance. With this Card of Temperance, this is about um, going through a transition, a transition that will help you find a solution. Because I see that you are looking for one. With this two of pentacles. Something may be quite confusing. And um, you may not understand what to do next. Here you are handling a lot of things. Maybe you are in a relationship where you feel like you are burdened. Or you are taking care of everything. You just cannot um, take a break. You might be feeling tired. You might be feeling like this relationship is filled with challenges. You handle one. Another one appears and it keeps going on. So with this two of pentacles, there could be a situation where you might be already wondering what to do next and um, what should be your approach. Here we have this queen of wands also. So with this queen of wands, this person may say something or may do something that will trigger you and um, you will feel like you just cannot take it anymore. You are done. And um, here you see this woman. She has this little dragon. This little dragon is really angry. So these are the feelings that you were hiding. Here this dragon is coming out of um, this skirt, this cloth. So this dragon was hiding all the time. This could be something that you were not aware of, but it was inside you. Some kind of frustration, some kind of doubt that was building up. And... Um, you never thought that it would be at this point. It would get to this point and um, you will eventually burst. You will eventually start expressing your emotions. This is the point where you need to know what should be done and what should not be. It's about drawing the boundaries. It's about expressing yourself. Queen of Wands is about being carefree, being genuine, being who you are and uh, not letting anything take control over you okay because we have this two of cups here so you might be dealing with someone who seems so familiar who seems to be perfect for you you may be feeling like you are twins for some of you this could be a case of twin flame where you both feel like you are piece of same soul or you are just mirror image of each soul and um i mean your soul each other mirror image of each other and um here it's about uh you know, trying everything that you could to save this relationship. But nothing um, may work in this situation. And the tarot is telling you, if this is the case, you need to draw the boundaries. This person needs some lessons with this Eight of Pentacles. Here you see this little fly taking a lesson from the teacher. So it's about uh, universe teaching them something. This is about their lesson. This is something that they need to learn. There was this love. It's great. You both feel like you have known each other for ages and you are the same. It's great. It feels deep. It feels nice. But then, how can you ignore something that is uh, obviously a red flag? I mean, here, probably this person is expecting everything from you. You might be taking too much burden of this relationship. You might be feeling like it's you who is interested in keeping this relationship alive. They don't care much. They don't do much. So with this Eight of Pentacles, Tara is telling you, speak up for yourself. With this Queen of Wands, what is yours is yours. You cannot lose it. Maybe you were afraid that uh, you would lose your own uh, part. Or you can say someone who is so close to you. Someone who seems to be like soulmate or a twin flame. Whatever the situation is, you might be afraid of losing this person. Because you feel some kind of extraordinary connection with them. Remember, what is yours cannot be taken away from you. Okay, that is the biggest thing you need to 
have trust in. You need to know that if this person is meant for you, if this is your part, because I do see that for some of you, it could be a twin flame uh, story or it could be a twin flame connection. Whatever it is, it will always come back to you. What is meant for you is not going anywhere. In fact, here at this point, this lesson is very necessary. With this Eight of Pentacles, this person needs to know what boundaries are and how boundaries should be respected. So be this Queen of Wands and let this person know what you are feeling like and what you expect from this relationship. However, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reverse as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. The Emperor, Eight of Wands, Three of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, and Knight of Swords. Okay. So here we have the Emperor. With this Emperor, this is about um, taking control of the situation. So probably you are dealing with someone who feels that they can dominate this connection or they can make you do make you do whatever they want you to do. It's like uh, taking you for granted. This person feels that since you have this feeling, you both are so connected, you are so romantically involved with them. Nothing can go wrong no matter what they do. You will always find an explanation. You will always try to see the positive side and uh, you will keep ignoring those red flags. You will do everything possible to stay connected. But here, with this eight of wands Tara is telling you open your eyes you just cannot see the light around you might not be aware of the positivity that is around you something that is trying to protect you here you see these lights it's about um, the light that is protecting you love of the universe love of your higher self and um, you just cannot see this light because your eyes are closed all you might be seeing at this point is darkness so see the truth, open your eyes and know that you're protected. Standing for yourself cannot harm you in any way. You are never going to lose something genuine just because you're doing the justice. In fact, universe wants you to do, to do the justice because with this temperance, universe is telling you, I'm taking care of you. What are you afraid of? I'm taking you where you're supposed to be. Just um, trust me. Okay, because that could be the hardest thing to do at this point. We have the three of wands here. With the three of wands, this person might be trying to see what's coming next. Okay, this person knows that uh, they have been really slow. With this knight of pentacles, they do know that. They should have given you commitment. They should have um, stuck to their commitment. They should have uh, um, followed what they told you. Or follow their own rules that they keep breaking every now and then. As if rules are only meant for you. Knight of Swords is now getting desperate. Okay. And this Knight of Swords is about you, I think. You may have this feeling that uh, things are getting out of control. The more you try to keep this relationship alive, the more challenges this person creates. The more issues this person brings up. And um, there is always something to argue on. Okay, if that is the situation, Tara is telling you, draw clear boundaries, let them know what is right and what is not. With the three of wands, this is about looking into the future. Tara is telling you, don't be short-sighted, look into the future and think about what would be the consequences if you uh, stay here for too long. I mean, <laughs> this is about uh, weighing what is coming next if you stay in this kind of relationship if you do not draw the boundaries now let's check an oracle message for you intuition you hold the answers you know the truths ancient one awaits behind the doors of the mind so this card is telling you that you have strong intuition you already know what the truth is you know what is coming next so there is a lot of wisdom waiting for you to have those uh, wise thoughts and uh, 
try to see clearly. And remember, standing for the justice, standing for yourself, never harms anyone. So this was the reading. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.